top players on a fitting stage. That's what we're talking about. A match of colossal importance and one that has captured the imagination of anyone with an interest in this great game of football. Now we're truly ready for what will be a showdown. It's Barcelona. They take on Real Sociedad next on EA TV. Hello, wherever you happen to be. Welcome to Catalonia. Welcome to Barcelona. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And on the menu for you today, live action from La Liga EA Sports. It's Barcelona up against Real Sociedad. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. It's there for him. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Subeldia. Subimendi. It's with Oyal Sabal. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. A glorious chance. And it goes to square the game. What a contest this is turning out to be. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Well, they needed that and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. So back underway following the equaliser. Ronald Araujo. Christensen. Araujo. Pedri. Here's Christensen. Joao Cancelo. An encouraging move from Barca. Christensen. Onto de Jong. Ronald Araujo. Now with de Jong. Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Well, that was incisive. Gundogan! Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Oyar Sabal. And the emphasis is on creativity. The cross is on. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. It's still alive. Extremely sloppy in possession. Difficult to stop him. And a chance to whip it in here. Great attacking play, and a decent save, full credit. It's a short one. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. They'll repeat the trick, corner again.
for the short one. Another corner. He's gone short with it, and with that, the attack fizzles out. Joao Cancelo, Pedri, and Real Sociedad with the ball again. Making progress. Might take the lead, and did just enough defensively. Can they hit on the break? He's in with a chance. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Mikel Marino. And what can they do to stop him running at them? Bryce Mendes. And he's got the beating of his opponent. It's a poor tackle. Reading it well. Oh, there it is! A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted nearly minutes. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Again here, this has been quite the roller coaster ride. Christensen. De Jong. Pedri. He's given us away. Not more. Good use of advantage by the referee. Javi Galan. Mikel Marino. Subimendi. It's neat passing. Confidence on the ball. Oh, surely! And the penalty is given. The referee right on the spot. And now a chance for them to take the lead here. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. This to give them the advantage. It could be up for grabs. And in the end, no damage done. De Jong. It's with Gundogan. Sociedad regaining possession. Subendia. Subimendi. Takafusa Kubo. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Nicely saved. Driven in the corner. That is that for the first half here. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. 
Well, he was excellent in that first half. He almost ran the game at times with his passing ability. Unless he's marked better in the second period, he'll continue to dictate the flow of this match. So back underway here into the second half. in the centre that is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances throw in for Real Sociedad here given him too much space but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending Joao Felix it's with Joao Cancelo Subi Mendy it's with Miguel Marino in possession Mendes here Can they forge ahead? It's still alive. But no, that's the end of the move because offside is the verdict. Araujo it's with Gundogan Ronald Araujo well sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position Gundogan Crossing possibilities. Just trying to keep their opponents on their toes with the passing game. Can he give them the lead? There it is! A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Well, the game has been restarted. 3-2 here. to get it out of there Mikel Marino Bryce Mendes getting forward could be and saved by the keeper now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Let's see about the delivery. Did his job defensively. Next 
ultimate assessment of the situation at the back. Bryce Mendes. Kubo. Cancelo. Is this the moment? And the challenge, crisp and clean. Well, as you can hear, the fans think that should have been a penalty, but I'm not convinced. 15 minutes left for play. And a timely intervention. Ronald Araujo. Gundogan. Promising move from Barcelona. Takes aim. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. <laughs> now sending it in. Gets his glove on it. Gundogan. Again, Gundogan. Kunde. And here's Cancelo. Jules Kunde on the ball. Good looking move. Is this the moment? And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Andre Silva. Kubo. And it comes down to the final five minutes. Subi Mendy. What to like about that pass? Crossing opportunity, and the keeper there to catch it, under no real pressure. Good tackle. Now, who can he play it to? Oh, could be an opportunity here. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw in. Substitution time as is here. Lewandowski. And return to Cancelo. Here's Rafinha. And the final whistle has sounded, the end of the game here, a win for Barcelona. Their fans are going to be happy about that. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, a spectacular contribution from Joao Felix. Full of substance. Stuart, I wonder how you would assess his performance. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.